Hey guys, what's up? It's Nadine Jolie here and welcome back to my channel and another part of our legacy. So a couple of things. My game, I've been going through it ever since I moved our legacy household into this house. And so what I decided was that, well, I do know that it's better to play on a 30 by 30 and a 44 by 40 lot when you're playing with legacy households and i was accidentally playing on a 60 by 60 when this house is originally a 40 by 40 so i went ahead and moved the house here we are located right here so we were here but now we're here and i went ahead and moved the house to a 40 by 40 lot and it's actually working a lot better i also had to get rid of a couple of things or redo a couple of things for example his room is pretty much redone her room has a couple of things that are redone as well and i had to take out like a couple of things like for example the tv was just way too big and it was kind of glitchy and i just took out some of those pillows to see if the pillows were like too high quality which they were so i had to go ahead and take those out and i just took out a little bit of other stuff i haven't went into build by mode yet in this save and i also feel like as soon as I'm done building and buying, that my game kind of crashes right after. So I'm going to refrain from going into build and buy mode or saving, then going into build and buy mode so that I can keep where I was, you know, whatever. So today is Kara's birthday. This is her babysitter, and he is dressed up. So today's Kara's birthday. She's going to be. That was loud. Watch TV for eight hours to earn bonus cash. Yes, eight hours watching TV. For uh, the kids are at school. I went ahead and gave Val a makeover. She is so freaking pretty. <laughs> so they're at school right now. A couple of other things that I did, I guess I could announce. Uh, I placed a family in this house. Uh, it's from the original save file for Evansdale County. Um, when I started playing with Evansdale County, the other save file, the populated one, I really liked uh, this one family that they kind of have you enter in as and it's a really cute little family and when i was playing in that save file with this legacy there was a big liking between um valencia and this guy tyler who, who lives there so i was thinking of having tyler be like oh she needs to work on that late homework he's not doing too good tyler to be like her little boyfriend because he was like super duper cute and i don't know he had a very distinctive look like he was black and he had blonde hair and i was like oh wow i like him he's cute <laughs> so i think that that's who she's gonna end up with today in this in this play in this gameplay we're gonna tank is that your friend oh anyway in this gameplay we're gonna go out on a date with crystal to the recreation center maybe we can invite tyler as well or go with valencia as well she wants to sing karaoke and up holiday lights okay let's go ahead and put those holiday lights up then shoot put those holiday lights up hanging multicolor period oh oh crystal's coming home with us oh that's so tea okay so crystal's coming home with us <laughs> so that's tea i'm excited about that and uh also with moving them here i also got Good. their uh, goals got reset as well so I had to make sure that and then also instead of like using cheats I actually physically moved them so that's why we we're so broke <laughs> because we literally used all the money we had to move back into this house which is what we were supposed to do originally so uh, attend award ceremony oh my god are we do we go after school classes oh is school done wait is the reward ceremony no? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, and then she wants to have a slumber party. I think that would be a good idea. She wants to play chess, blah, 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 sing karaoke. I also want her to sign up. We'll do this. And then we're home with Crystal, so that's cool. Here's our girl Valencia. This is not her in her full amount, like, in her full extent, she- oh, wow. It's kind of far. Oh, is, is she not gonna go to his little recital? Yeah, don't go home, go to his recital. 
you don't go to his recital because Crystal's here and we don't want to leave her. Let's help with homework. Let's do our homework together. Is she gonna work out? I was about to say. Turned on classical music. It's nice. What are you gonna do with her? <laughs> what are you gonna do with her? Wait, what are her traits? Oh, we just still don't even freaking know. Okay, well then don't do your homework yet. Let's get to know her. Let's be friendly with her. Share secret. Oh, just kidding. Yeah, do your homework then. <laughs> and then she's like being best friends with her little imaginary friend, which is what she's supposed to be doing. Sparky, just sitting there living his best life. Okay. Walk snurgy live. I think that's cool. So wait, he must H up soon. Two days, yeah. So we'll definitely go out. We'll definitely go out with uh, Crystal tonight. This is a Saturday. Mine as well. Maybe wab up, Jolay. How they sign up for after school? They're kind of far apart in age, so I want to move this up to like five days. He ages up like literally in two days, and at least you know she'll have three days left when he's a young adult, because he needs to get started with doing stuff. He's not my heir. I will admit, I don't think Sandstone is the guy that I want to continue with. Even though he has the love and he has, you know, his painting skill is almost. Oh, it's like oh my god, it's so low. <laughs> it needs to get that up. When he comes home from, um, I'll have him paint. Paint small, I guess. He's tired. <laughs> Let's see, it says Sandstone should be proud of all he has accomplished. After school activities have helped Sandstone improve at many skills and have given him a boost in future successes. Awesome! Well, this damn dog. Stop. No more howling along. <laughs> no more. Let's talk to Crystal. How, how much does she have? Oh, 60%? Are we done? Did we finish that quickly? No, we didn't finish. Let's do her homework. <laughs> Let's see. What can we do? We can chat. And then... Gossip. Oh, she's super stressed out. I guess I can give her a little break. I mean, it, it's Friday. She she has all weekend to do it. She's like super, super stressed out. Mom is coming home. Pranked? Whoopee cushion. Oh my god, who did that? It's mom coming home on a bike for me. She is so unserious sometimes. She's tired too. Is she hungry? No. I'll have her take a little nap. Did I mean meal? Oh, we still didn't. No, that's not her problem. Not her problem. Just <laughs> change her. We didn't get an email. Kind of tired, so I'm probably gonna have her nap, and then I'll have her work out, or like go to the gym or something. No one's gonna drive though. What are you doing? Come here. That'd be romantic. Kiss her or something, and then we'll ask her out on a date. We could also give her one of our our let's give it to her let's gift it let's see friendly give gift this one whoa 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 <laughs> that is really loud <laughs> could uh feed her sit and feed kara oh Right in front of dad? 
Interesting. You know what? I'm not gonna lie. I don't think they've ever wooed. And I feel like right now wouldn't be a bad time to woo. I think, okay, I think my woohooer thing is, might be off for teens. But like, I think it's time to lose his, you know, his B. I think it's time. Give gift, yeah. And then hold hands. I think right now is the time. It has to be. I just romantic boohoo. Ooh. Right in front of his dad is so unsweet. I need her to get up and, uh, she's just napping? Okay, yeah, I need her to serve dinner. Uh, can she make spaghetti? Make some spaghetti, it's cheaper. I've been making out for a little minute. But we're gonna go out on a date after. Because <laughs> it is seven. Where are they gonna go? The shower? Oh, no. Okay, cancelled. Okay, cool. Let's just ask her out on a date then. I wish we knew how to drive. We still didn't learn. Or can sex. Let's put this up somewhere. Put it up here. Oh, I guess we can't. What they get from graduating from the art club. It's actually really cute. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Okay, so we're on a date. Conversation. Who? We could coo over children, I guess. But, like, both don't have any. Oh! oh. <laughs> Hold on, girl. Hold on. Don't age up just yet. He said he wants to watch a movie. Okay, if there's a movie on right now, we can go. Is there a movie? Watch a movie with. Um... Wait, do I have it on date? Yeah. And then we'll go see the psycho, whatever, and then we'll come here with our date. Like fun. Should we go eat? I'll have a meet there. But oh my gosh, it's Gar's birthday. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh. I need to see. Hates the outdoors. Nice. I don't know how I feel about that. Just because she wasn't potty trained. Like, could you imagine? Just because you're not potty trained? Host a tea party. He was supposed to age up with her. At least she came out cute. We also have... What else can we do? Uh, play. We also have a... a thing out here. She'll go and play in the playhouse. What is she doing? She's cooking, and then I'll have her do this little watch TV thing. What is she doing? She needs to do her homework. There's a lot of wall. Whose phone is ringing? Hers? Yes, uh, Oh, the damn dog. Why are you waking him up? <laughs> we'll still get him a little play date. Alright, let's see. <laughs> I think mom is done with making spaghetti. Improve? Yes, for sure. We can do that. Go ahead, grab the plate. And then we'll go late night, late night gym with, um, Disgusting food? Where? Oh, here. Mom, come here. Clean this up. Come grab a plate. Are you guys- oh, they're still at the movies. What time does this, the Rex and her clothes? I hope that they'll be able to make it. Alright, let's 
continue to report. I don't know if I'm shower. How's mom feeling? I'm a little hungry. She should have ate. Then she's tired too, so I have her. Oh, we have to redo her room for sure since she's like old enough. She has nowhere to sleep. I guess I'll have her sleep in the treehouse. I just went ahead and remade Kara's room. I didn't do too much to it. You know, I just made it look a little bit more little girlish. Super cute in here. <laughs> and then I also wanted to still play a little bit more with Generations. So I'm going to have her dream about being royal. All right. What are you doing? Recording, shower. I guess I'll just have her work out here. And then he is going to the rec center, so we'll play with him. We'll have a little bit of fun. Why are there always somebody in the middle of the street there? I gotta reset the town, get rid of some of the homeless <laughs> for sure, so I can clean out the game a little bit. Awesome, so we are at the rec center. Is it still open? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool, cool. Nobody attending the... Buy a snack, I'll buy a brownie. I'm tired. Oh, terrible thriller. Oh, that's X. Or, oh, wait. Let's try this. Grab a... A soda. Buy a soda. That should... OMG, where is she going? Is she leaving? Probably gonna go build a snowman or something. Take the soda. Move full with our date. Azur has submitted a thorough report on Nina, Caliente's activities, Elias's, and Accomplices. Pretty damn cool. And I guess our reports just needs to get a little bit better. We still need to start questioning some more people. Sleep after. What's she doing? She's sleeping. She's sleeping. Her shower after. Eat. Eat then shower. <laughs> Cute little date night at the rec center. It's bowling night. It's kind of late, but but whatever. They're about to graduate. <laughs> really has one more day. <laughs> it's dark, not dizzy. All right, let's see. Kind of bad. This rec center is so cute. It's really big too. A lot to do in here. Hope is here. Anthony Cavalli is super tall. And I think he just turned a teen. He's actually really cute. <laughs> okay, so I think I have somebody for Valencia to get with because he is like super duper cute. Oh, and that's Deborah. Probably has that big head pandemic. Look at the size of that thing. I tried to get rid of them all. He is so tall and actually really cute. Like, I'm here for it. <laughs> I am so here for it. I think this has to be her next man. Like, he is just like so cute in the face. Like, oh my god, he's really cute. Okay, so we'll make sure of it. We'll make sure that that is her next man for sure. All right, let's go and well, they're bowling now. They're bowling now. Maybe he can catch a prize for her. That'd be kind of romantic. He's a little tired, so I'm not gonna have him out too long. I think I'll have him come and grab a prize for her. Is it just me or did they change? That lag. Definitely needs to practice. So does she. She sucks. What? 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 
didn't even know Hope was pregnant. Don't freak out with him. <laughs> so loud. Don't freak out. We'll grab a prize so we can go. I think after he's done grabbing a prize, we can have him introduce himself to Anthony. Oh! Girl, she's like freaking out. Freaking the hell out. Oh, my arrow trap. I was like, that lag was bad. Did we get it? No, we didn't. Okay, where is our girl? And we could tell her goodbye because we want to go home. A romantic little hands. All right, stop. <laughs> some more hug, and then give her some flowers. Can we afford it? Not really. So we won't. Sailor. Oh, bye. Dead. We'll kiss her goodbye. I'm tired. They're so cute. We're dead. Even though she, did, she can't stand art. Yeah. The only thing I'm like, I don't know if we want her for real. Because that part kind of scares me a little bit. If you don't like art and we're artistic, like, it just didn't make any sense. It's goodbye. Go home. Oh, stop. <laughs> I am over. Oh, I love you. Uh oh. Sleep after. I'm gonna have him sleep. Alrighty, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this part here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was kind of a short part, but we got some stuff done. And in the next part, it looks like we'll have a young adult, our first young adult, Sandstone. OMG, super excited. And we'll just keep working on those skills. I'm gonna have him painting. And he ultimately wants to max out his writing as well. So I'll have him writing and yeah. I think there's going to be so much to come of this whole series and I'm super duper happy that you guys are here joining me on this process. If you guys enjoyed it, please oh, phone's ringing. like, comment, and subscribe and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye guys.